All right, let's talk about the elephant in the room. Twitch is borked for another 28 days. Um, the reason for this is, let me, you know, I'll, I'll just pull it up and read it straight. Uh, so a partner conduct violation. Hello, my name. Uh, this is the partner conduct team in Twitch. Uh, you were recently reported for breaking Twitch terms of service and community guidelines. See below. Hateful conduct, plain armor three, and this is in quotes. You missed anyway because you're a faggot. End quote. We've gone ahead and deleted the VOD and uh, to avoid further reports. As a result, we will be issuing a 30-day suspension of your channel. Blah blah blah. Twitch conduct team. Uh, so. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm basically grounded right now on Twitch. Um, the reason this all happened, uh, I'm going to keep it brief, but uh, there was some internal TSB stuff. We had to um, ban a few people under a uh, whole fiasco, and uh, they thought it would be funny to make this clip. And I don't think they meant for it to be malicious, or at least some of them, but some of them then took that clip, went the extra mile, and based off of how Twitch auto-modding works, which I know now because I just spent two days deeply researching it, um, it just took off and then it skyrocketed to here. So naturally, I've appealed this. I explained the full situation, asking for leniency, because you guys know I don't hate any groups. You know, hateful conduct, that kind of insults me a bit because I have very few IRL friends and you know, out of the ten, three of them are gay, so <laughs> it just, I've had a good laugh about this, but, you know, we, we say stuff like that all the time, because it's a milsim game, but whatever. Going off of that, um, just a reminder, guys, for the people that know what's going on, don't, don't spread names, don't spread reasons. TSB handled it internally, because it was a TSB matter, so hopefully this same group of people won't do it again, but... This is showing that anyone could do something like this on Twitch, and I thought I was still in the bubble of I could still do what I need to without seeing these types of uh, repercussions. But again, after doing further research, the border for when you can start getting screwed by stuff like this is uh, your Twitch partner and you're averaging about 150 uh, viewers per stream. And we recently reached that just a few weeks ago. Um, right before I went away for vacation and came back and it quickly came up to those numbers. So if you're going for Twitch, you should you should pay attention because uh, this is where you can start getting screwed. So um, again, we've got about 28 days more of this and I have appealed it. I'm going for some leniency to try to get it reduced, not fully removed. Because again, based on how that clip said, uh, from what I've heard, it's it's in quotes, you know, and someone said that. Otherwise, you know, there wouldn't be a ban. I've I've actually never seen the clip either. I never got the chance. I was uh at my girlfriend's house the entire day because she just came back last Thursday and she's home alone. So, you know, we get to play house for a bit. But yeah, that's that's the worst part about all this. I I actually don't know the full context of the clip, so it was really hard to go into that in the appeal, but I just went off of historically, you know. No one means anything malicious about this, and I could literally go to bigger Arma 3 partnered channels and pull a clip like this, and, you know, if that, is that also against the terms? Because, yeah, but digressing here, not meaning to shift the blame in any way, it's just, it's frustrating to see this, uh, but, you know, it's... It can happen. So here's here's some of the changes we're making after this all goes away, whether it be in a few days after the appeal or in 28. Uh, I have to get rid of VODs and I have to get rid of clips. Because again, this all happened right under my nose uh, while I was away from my workstation to literally appeal any of this or stop this. Because if um, I got word of the clip being made... Um, three hours before the actual ban happened. If I had access to my computer, I would have gotten that deleted immediately, banned accounts to prevent people from doing it again. I could have stopped this, but again, I was out. So there, this could all happen again, you know? And that's what scares me the most about all of this. So uh, Twitch VODs are going to go. I'm sorry, guys. You're going to have to wait till it goes to YouTube. Um, clips being able to be made, that's also going to be, uh, removed. And if it's not, I'm literally going to task my mods if clips are made at the end of a stream to delete them. Because I can't risk it, guys. 
I'm sorry. Um, the only thing it serves to give me is a few extra bucks in ad revenue a month, which, you know, YouTube's much better at that regard. So I, I have to play defensive here. And I, again, really don't want to do it, but I, I can't risk this happening again. And I'll get into that in a second. But that's that's the Twitch changes we're going to make uh, as soon as uh, Twitch goes uh, unbanned. Uh, essentially, or unsuspended, whatever the heck you want to call it. Uh, now let's let's talk about the really scary part of this. So I, I didn't think it would be that much of an issue, but I've heard that when you're suspended, you don't get a payout from Twitch. Um, you, you might, I don't know, again, there was conflicting information here, but I don't get, I might, I might not get paid for Twitch for, um, my previous 60 days work. Um, and again, I, it, here's the issue. Here's the issue. I have about two and a half grand left on a college payment uh, for this semester for four classes at the, um, end of the month. Um, Twitch and donation was going to cover that. Uh, now instead I gotta go into savings, which I've already spent well above my budget for because of things like Katsukon, Otakon, uh, not Otakon, ColossalCon, um, and tickets for those stuff, and it's, you know, it's, it's about a grand and a half for all of that, and I did both of them because they were coming up, and again, I did we literally did them a few hours before this happened because I was with my girlfriend, we had to plan all this out, so just the timing of this was absolutely horrible, but now... You know that's all. That all would have gone into the college payment if I knew this would happen. But now that it's already been spent, so it's like fuck. You know, like, <laughs> like what the fuck? <laughs> so, I I hate to do this. Like I I hesitate to do this, but I need to because I I'm down like two almost two and a half grand for college. If you can give something on Patreon, guys, just for this month, so I can cover it. I, I hate to ask, like, really, it just, I'm not the type of person to do that, but uh, <sighs> fuck, like, just the, <laughs> just my luck this month, you know, it, yeah, anything, anything on Patreon for this month, and then you can take it away, take it away right after it goes through, I, <sighs> Uh, God, writing writing this out for for the Patreon post for my script was was a lot easier, but it's yeah. I'm gonna be working my ass off and uh, what I have in my brokerage account to um to try to make it up as well. And I uh, yeah. Fuck, you know, like it, I've had time to fully process everything, and the financial thing only came to me actually like a few hours ago because I'm like, wait, I still have stuff, you know, like I, yeah, that's that's the really scary part about this, guys. I don't like the Twitch suspension. Cool, it's a strike. I can we can live with that, but you know, falling behind on college payments and then having to possibly further delay that. It's, that's the, that's my future, potentially, if, you know, someone else goes for, after the YouTube channel, like, I still need to finish and get the degree, because if I, oh, man. yeah, now when I talk about it out loud, it all hits me. <laughs> all right, so that's, that's the issue, guys, like, I, I'm not gonna lie, I, I pro, I can probably cover it, um, worst comes to worst, I just take a big chunk out of the uh, stock brokerage account and uh, go from there. But, you know, then that further fucks me because this is, that's the emergency money I have aside for, you know, if I don't get my, how much money I need at the end of the month uh, for, you know, like eating or paying the video editors. And it's just, <sighs> I, I need a second. I'm sorry. All right. So I just, quickly cut out recording right after um yeah i'll i'll see what i can do uh but whew, it's it's scary to think about <laughs> i don't even know how to react i'm trying to laugh at it but yeah fuck so yeah um financially we're in a bit of a pickle but i can if you guys could help out that would be great but this will be the only fucking time i ask i swear to fucking god because uh, 
fuck, fuck, you know, just going forward, though, I, I am happy to say with um, how the new YouTube channel is doing, it's uh, it just got monetization rights about uh, last Tuesday. Um, it made on its first day uh, right on the Friday uh, before we um, fuck before we uh, released a video, you know, uh, weekly every Saturday. It made about six bucks. So at the lowest point every week, uh, lowest point for views, it makes six bucks. So I'm happy to see where that's gonna go because that again, when we started it two and a half months ago, that was gonna be the channel that took us to the big leagues, you know. Um, you know, a channel that could easily get like hundreds of thousands of subs and millions of views, and that money would go into, you know, paying for everything. So I could then focus less on, you know, relying on donations and the stock market and all these risks, all that risk stuff, you know? So I could do this all full time. Uh, but <laughs> again, I wish this, if I were to get copy, uh, this fucking suspension, I wish it happened like six months in the future because that would be after that channel would be established and I wouldn't have to worry as much. Uh, but at the very least, um, nah, fuck, I was about to say, at least I can use it to pay the editors yet, but I won't get the payout of that money till another 45 days from Tuesday, so I still pay out of pocket for the editors too. I, I didn't even think about that. Fuck! <laughs> oh man everything i think about just gets worse and worse but yeah we'll see we'll see how this keeps going uh you know i'll find more things to shoot myself in the foot with as i talk but uh that channel in about a year like i said started two and a half months ago already got monetization rights already has almost ten thousand subs gets like a hundred thousand views a month right now, which about every thousand views is a dollar right now. It's uh, it's about a dollar twenty, I would say. Sometimes a dollar thirty-five. So again, that money goes right back into paying the editors, and I'm trying to, you know, pay them well um, because I I can or I could at least <laughs> as of two days ago I could. <laughs> And, um, you know, just to keep that channel's momentum going, um, because the, the main channel's kind of stagnated and it's just relying on YouTube hits uh, for going viral. Because, again, last November, they made a policy change. So if your channel is like below 100,000, you're on a different algorithm track and yada da. But, you know, that channel will spearhead, uh, the new one will spearhead the other one and the Twitch, if it ever comes back. <laughs> but, yeah. So. Long term, everything should be okay. Uh, it's just short term, I'm in a pickle <laughs> because of all of this. So I'm just scrolling down on my list here. Um, yeah, there's also, fuck, more bad news. The issue of um, Twitch had a lot, a big revenue chunk from Twitch right now, which by the way, Twitch covers about 30% of my revenue right now. Donations covers another 30%, so I'm losing like 60% of everything. And then there's going to be some fallout with Twitch because, you know, the sub count's going to heavily drop because, of course, you can't resub to a channel that is not there. And this is, at most, a 30-day ban, so I'm going to lose every single resub. <laughs> so that's going to that's gonna be, have to be rebuilt. So, yeah. Um, but... You know the Twitch, the Twitch payout won't like that. This will only hit me financially like in a month to month and a half. It's just what's concerning is I don't know if I'm not going to get paid in four days, and that money I really kind of need. But digressing here, you know, just that's more of the possible fallout here. But some good news, some some good stuff. Uh, when when we get back on Twitch, I'm gonna probably you know put a YouTube video and say, hey, gonna do this uh, massive stream. It's going to be a 12 or 24 hour, depends on my mood, depends on the day. And we're just going to do ops. We're going to do uh, mission prep. We're going to do some R&R, &R, some experimentation, research, and where's R&R &R relaxation? I don't fucking know. Uh, R&D is the term, research and development for ops and uh, some fallout, New Vegas. And I'm going to start fashioning my mask of, okay, I got to really watch what I say now because there's people gunning for my channel, which, yeah, like... I, I've got to do that, but there's other people that won't have to worry about it, so, you know. Lucky them. <laughs> but regardless, I also have a lot of um, spare keyboards and mice, and I might reach out to my Logitech partner for a few more things. Um, 
just to give away uh and i'll you know go out of pocket if i can um I'll, i might again might have to wait um till the next 15 day period then i'll get the twitch payout quickly shovel that money to college and if there's anything left i'll start doing shipping but i'll create a list of uh you know giveaway stuff and we'll we'll just go right into that and then as soon as i have the financial capital i'll um I'll ship those uh, things out again. Some cool Logitech gear that I have in my basement that I've always said I'll give away, but I've never had the time. Uh, but I'll definitely make the fucking time. And again, 28 days without streaming. Um, I'll talk in a second how that is going to give me more time. But yeah, uh, fun, fun stuff. You know, we'll talk about we'll talk about the whole time of things right now. Let me also say this, guys. I have no plans to go stream on Mixer or YouTube because I don't know. Again, this is where I got conflicting research. If my partnership exclusivity deal um, goes under suspension, meaning I'm free from the contract right now. Um, I cuz again I don't want this to go bigger than what it is and I don't want to be that reason uh if it does go bigger because uh, like if that if that if Twitch gets extended for the suspension I'm screwed. <laughs> I am honestly fucking screwed. At that point I'll go into like you know Mixer do YouTube stuff and just abandon Twitch completely but it's it's going to be that's going to fuck me short term pretty fucking hard so yeah, again, don't want to do that, but I have no interest in streaming on other platforms because I have to also set all that up too, and that's going to take a while. But in that time where I'm normally, you know, streaming ops and stuff instead, I can do video uh, editing and video processing while I uh, prep ops and stuff. So that's going to help me keep releasing YouTube content, which by the way, for YouTube, uh, I'm going to bump that number up from three or two to three videos, uh, daily to th uh, four to five. I've already scheduled, uh, up until Wednesday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday have been done. And after I finish this video, I'm going to keep working on it until I can get about a week ahead. Um, even the shenanigans channel, it has next week's video already done. And, uh, in about two weeks, I might start dropping bi-weekly Wednesday videos for a double upload to, again, help spearhead that channel. Cause I've got two editors now working full time. Um, and it, it should work out, but yeah, uh, I think, I think that's everything in my notes here to talk about, um, oh yeah, no, on a final note, on a final fucking note. Thank you to everyone that reached out on Discord and gave me some kind words. That that was that was the saving grace cuz I am not going to lie, I was very close to just saying fuck it, opening my savings, uh taking everything out of my stock account and just putting it to college payments and then banking on Bloodwing's decent position at her current job to get me a good referral at her company and um, working there at, uh, as a cyber guy because um, that's that's one of my abilities because um, when, when you have when you work years on something and you make it your own you work with a lot of cool people and you build something, and then one of those people does something like this, even as an accident, it hurt. It really hurt. It... I'm going to keep going, because TSB, again, has been having some other issues, and I'm one of the few fives left that has to keep order, and you know, soon I'm going to be one of the very few left and I have to get new blood up there. But uh, shit, I didn't I said I wouldn't talk about TSP stuff. But yeah, it's, there's there's a lot going on right now, guys. And this was like the worst time thing to drop at the worst possible moment. And it's it's just going to make it make me stronger, hopefully as a person. But yeah, it hurts. It hurts a lot. But thank you guys for cheering me on. And I, I hope I can keep being the guy that is worthy of your cheering on.
because I'm hurting a lot right now. I still have a lot of work to do, but I'm hurting a lot. God, I didn't want this all to be so sad. Like, fuck. But. Fuck, I'm usually a lot better about holding my emotions in, but. And, and guys, I will say this too, and this is going to piss a lot of people off, but I'm never going to do a face reveal after this. The fact that people are willing to go after me personally, I have to, I have to keep my identity hidden. At most, you're going to know my first name. Um, and I'm actually going to go, I, I know my Facebook account got leaked uh, to some people within TSB um, a few years ago as a joke. That's, that's all deleted now or is in the process of being deleted. I can't risk this. Because people are willing to go after me. So, yeah. And then if I have to abandon all this just so I can eat every day and make money to, like, live with a fucking roof on my head, I can't risk any of that coming in in an IRL situation. So, yeah. If, if you're ever around uh, Northern Virginia, though, and you want to get a drink, by all means, I still have that open. But, nah, I'm, I'm not going to... I, I can't do a face reveal, guys. I can't show myself because this is this is scary. This is sad, and this is this got me scared. So, yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna end this by saying let's let's go get this armor bread. Uh, if you have any questions, drop them in chat. I'm still going to be recording my ops, guys, uh, for the next 28 days. I'm still going to be hosting my fucking ops. Um, and I'm not going to let anything get in my way anymore. Because, yeah, I can't. I literally can't. Because, yeah, <laughs> you know? So, thanks for listening. I'm sorry this was long. I didn't mean for this to be long. Some of this was me rambling, but... I can't bring myself to do retakes anymore because I've been sitting at my chair for like an hour trying to trying to get all this public and I yeah <laughs> whatever <sighs> be careful out there on the internet guys keep yourself safe you could just piss off the wrong person and then they can go after you like this. <sighs> Be nice to people. Please. But that's all I got. So we got four videos coming out later in the day. Um, it's just whatever I've got. I'm going in order. But uh, yeah. We'll... Uh, We'll get through this. Fuck, normally I end these with something witty, but it's just not there right now. And I mean, like I can't even... <laughs> yeah, I, I have a, I'm have playing Fallout on the side. Not the Fallout uh, playthrough I'm doing that I'm I was streaming, but, you know, a different character. I can't even play that for more than 30 minutes before just shutting down but i can't take a break right now because i i don't have money <laughs> i don't have the, the i can't let things die out right now as much as i know some people would want that to happen so yeah cheers guys uh go operate operationally and uh i'll see you next time